If today is Sunday, then which day is it exactly on 10 raised to 10th day? Here, first I will explain the concept here. If first day is Sunday, then what is 30th day? To find this, take the difference between 30 and 1. Because first day we already know it is Sunday. Then the remaining days are 30 minus 1, 29 days. That is, apart from this first day Sunday, there are 29 remaining days. So, find the odd numbers in the remaining days. 29 by 7 will give you reminder 1. 7 goes 4 times in 28. So, remaining is 1. Reminder 1 means there are 1 number of odd days. So, Sunday plus 1 will give you Monday as 30th day. That is, if first day is Sunday, then 1 plus 7 8th day is also Sunday. Again, 8 plus 7, 15th. And 15 plus 7, 22nd. And 22nd plus 7, 29. These are, these are also Sundays. Which means 29 plus 1 is 30th day. Then Sunday plus 1 will give you Monday. Which we already explained here. Now, you can also take 30 by 7 method. That is 30 by 7 will give you Reminder 2, which means in this 30 days, we already included this first day as Sunday. Then, this will give you Reminder 2. If you include Sunday, this will give you Reminder 2, which means there are two number of order days and first order day is Sunday. First day is Sunday, then second order day is Monday, which means 30th day is Monday. So, in this way, you have to calculate this. That is, you can calculate either way, but you need to understand the concept here. Now, if today is Sunday, what is exactly on 10 raised to 10th day? That is, today is Sunday, which means first day is Sunday. That is, today is the first day here. Note the tomorrow. Tomorrow is second day. Don't consider tomorrow as the first day because today is already a first day. Then tomorrow is second day. Then we need to find out 10 rise to 10th day. 10 rise to 10th day. Now, here I am not taking the difference between 10 rise to 10 and first day. And I will write 10 rise to 10 by 7 directly and find the reminder from this. Here, 10 is the base in the numerator and 7 is the base in the denominator. Then 10 by 7 will give you reminder 3. Now, here 7 is in the denominator. So, a prime number is in the denominator. A prime number is in the denominator means torsion is equal to 1 less from the prime number 7. That is, 7 minus 1 gives you 6. So, 6 is the torsion here. If 6 is the torsion, then here power is, in numerator power is 10. So, 10 by 6 will gives you reminder 4, which means here this is 3 raised to 4. Numerator, this is 3 raised to 4. That is, we are reducing a larger form into a smaller form. That is, 10 by 7 will gives you reminder 3 and here 7 is a prime number. So, take 1 less from 7. So, torsion here is equal to 6. Then, power is 10. So, 10 by 6 will give you reminder 4, which means power is 4 here. 3 raised to 4 is numerator and in denominator, we have prime number 7. So, 3 raised to 4 is equal to 81 by 7. 81 by 7 will give you reminder 4. Reminder is 4 means, here I didn't subtract this 1 from 10 raised to 10, which means this reminder 4 includes Sunday as well. So, Sunday plus 3 reminder, 1 less from this reminder will give you Wednesday. Here, reminder is 4 means there are 4 odd days. So, here, first odd day is Sunday because we didn't subtract 1 from 10 raised to 10. We already included this Sunday in 10 raised to 10 days. So, first day is Sunday, then second odd day is Monday, third is Tuesday and fourth odd day is Wednesday. And here, Option A is your right answer. But here, this is exactly after 10 raised to 10th day. 
So on 10 raised to 10th day, on 10 raised to 10th day, it is Wednesday. Then after 10 raised to 10th day, it is Thursday.